Now, your latest headlines and most accurate forecast from 41 Action News. Good morning, I'm Taylor Himness. It's Friday, June 26. The Missouri State Highway Patrol investigating an officer involved shooting in Independence. It happened near Truman and Blue Ridge Boulevard around 3 o'clock Friday morning. Police were reporting to an apartment complex in the area on a domestic dispute call. They noticed a separate armed carjacking happening. That led to shots fired between two suspects and police officers. We're told one of the suspects was hit and was taken to the hospital. The other suspect is in custody. None of the officers were hurt. Today, Kansas City, Missouri Mayor Quinton Lucas will meet with business owners in the 18th and Vine District, along with members of the KCPD, to talk about solutions to violent crime in Kansas City. The meeting comes after a violent weekend around the 18th and Vine District, with four, sh four shootings last Sunday, followed by a fatal shooting early Monday morning. That meeting is this morning at 10 a.m. at the Black Archives of Mid-America. And this morning, healthcare staff at the Samuel Rogers Health Center will hold a Black Lives Matter demonstration starting at 730. At 745, all staff will kneel in silence for 8 minutes 46 seconds. That to honor George Floyd and other black people who have lost their lives because of police brutality. And medical leaders at Children's Mercy are talking about COVID-19 and school reentry today. Experts in infectious disease, sports medicine, developmental and behavioral medicine and environmental health will be hosting a webinar for school leaders on key things to consider for creating a healthy back to school environment. They're talking this morning at 1130. Let's get to Lindsay Anderson with a hot forecast. Hot and humid today. High temperatures are climbing to the low 90s. We're going to notice a blend of sun and clouds. And with the humidity in place, heat index values will get to the upper 90s. We will track thunderstorms that will develop this evening and overnight tonight, some of which may be severe and bring us some heavy, much needed rainfall. You can get the latest news and weather anytime at KSHB.com.